Starting off with an armored giant. Earlier this year, scientists discovered one of the best preserved ankylosaur fossils of all time. After being swept out to sea more than 100 million years ago, the animal was interred belly up on the ocean floor. Speaking of well-preserved animals, this incredible cave lion cub was found in the Siberian permafrost. This beautiful cub is estimated to be at least 20,000 years old, hailing from the last Ice Age glaciation. Staying with ancient youngsters, the identity of a famous dinosaur known as Baby Louie came into focus this year. Louie's egg was laid by an oviraptorosaur, a dinosaur that would have looked a lot like an overgrown cassowary. In more egg news, a treasure trove of over 200 pterosaurs was unearthed in China. Pterosaurs aren't common in the fossil record, and their thin-shelled eggs are extremely rare. Until the first pterosaur eggs were discovered in 2004, paleontologists weren't sure these animals laid eggs at all. From flying reptiles to extinct hatchlings, an amber specimen from Myanmar revealed an incredible, nearly complete fossil bird specimen. At just two and a half inches long, the ancestral bird hails from the late Cretaceous, about 100 million years ago. And two more amber specimens contained incredible insect fossils. The oldest fossil blood-sucking tick still attached to its dinosaur host, and a googly-eyed bug that represented a new branch of the insect family tree. Over to France, where modern scanning technology allowed paleontologists to get a new view of a salamander mummy found over a century ago. The 35 to 40 million year old animal's insides, including muscles, nerves, organs, and even parts of the salamander's last meal were studied in detail. Over to China, where 160 million year old rock contained the skeletons of the first fuzzballs to take to the air. The mammals weren't true flying squirrels, but the petrified duo had membranes that stretched from ankle to wrist. Rounding off with a recent addition, this crazy dino was so strange, scientists initially suspected it was fake. Much like Velociraptor, the creature was a small predator with sickle-shaped claws, but a swan-like neck and bill set the fossil apart. That's it for this week. We want your opinions on these nature news stories. Be sure to let us know what you think in the comments below.